क्वेश्चन ट्वेंटी फाइव फाइंड द मास ऑफ ईच एलिमेंट इन सेवन पॉइंट एट फोर ग्राम ऑफ फेरस अमोनियम सल्फेट वॉट विल बी द वॉल्यूम ऑफ ऑक्सीजन एट एन टी पी इन दिस सैम्पल द मास ऑफ फेरस अमोनियम सल्फेट इज सेवन पॉइंट एट फोर ग्राम फर्स्ट वी नीड टू फाइंड द मोल्स ऑफ फेरस अमोनियम सल्फेट सो मोल्स ऑफ फेरस अमोनियम सल्फेट विल बी weight divided by molecular weight which is equal to 7.84 divided by 392 which is equal to 0.02 moles now in one mole of ferrous ammonium sulfate the number of moles of iron is 1 so the weight of iron is 56 grams therefore in 0.02 moles of the compound the weight of iron is 56 into 0.02, which is equal to 1.12 gram. In one mole of ferrous ammonium sulfate, the number of moles of sulfur is 2. Therefore, the weight of sulfur is 64 grams in one mole of the compound. Therefore, in 0.02 moles of the compound, the weight of sulfur is 64 into 0.02, which is equal to 1.28 grams. Now, in one mole of compound, the number of moles of oxygen atom is 14. So, the weight of oxygen atom is 224 grams, which we obtain by multiplying. the number of moles of oxygen atom with its atomic weight that is 14 into 16 therefore in 0.02 moles of the compound the weight of oxygen atom is 224 into 0.02 which is equal to 4.48 grams now in 1 mole of the compound the number of moles of hydrogen is 20 Therefore, the weight of hydrogen is twenty grams, and in point zero two moles of the compound, the weight of hydrogen will be twenty into point zero two, which is equal to zero point four grams. The number of moles of nitrogen is two. Therefore, the weight of nitrogen is twenty eight grams. So one mole of the compound contains twenty eight grams of nitrogen. So point zero two moles of the compound will contain 0.02 into 28 which is equal to 0.56 grams of nitrogen the number of moles of oxygen atoms is 14 now we know that each oxygen molecule is made up of two atoms of oxygen and here the number of oxygen atoms present is 14 so the number of oxygen molecules which will be formed from one molecule of the compound will be 14 divided by 2 which is equal to 7 so the number of moles of oxygen that will be evolved from one mole of the compound will be 7 moles of oxygen therefore from 0.02 moles of the compound the number of moles of oxygen evolved will be 0.02 into 7 which is equal to 0.14 mole now we know that one mole of any gas occupies 22.4 liters therefore the volume of oxygen at ntp will be 0.14 into 22.4 which is equal to 3.136 liter